It shows you the visual. So you're talking physical blood. They have to have this blood so there. No, the seed. The, the, I'm not talking the blood. blood. You have to be in the seed of Abraham, Isaac, Isaac. Exactly. I'm not saying. Is that a spirit? I'm not saying. Or is, it, is it a spirit or is it's it a, a nationality? Is it a biological? It's a nationality in a certain spirit. It's where you're born? No, it's not where you're born. Because if I was born in China, right. so where, if I was, if I was born in China, would you determine my nationality as Chinese? Look at me now. Come on now. Oh, come on. Would you, if I, if you see me now, I'm like, hey, bro, what's up, what's up? Now I come back. I'm from China. I'm born and raised in China. Hey, bro, what's up? Am I Chinese? No, it's not. Where you from is not. Where you, where you, where you, no, that's not true because I've been, like, I've traveled in, in the Middle East, right? And there's areas, most people there are obviously, like, you know, brown or white. Like, okay. He was doing what? Were they not? Think, but they speak Arabic. If you, if you grew up, if, if you were born and, and grew up in, in Africa, would you be African? Oh, so why would I be Chinese if I was in China? Right, Come on, man. Come on. Okay, so it's not physical food. What is it though? It's who your father is. That's who your father is. Yeah, so what if your father is a slave owner who, you know. My father? I mean, hypothetically. Right? Like, not if nobody has pure blood. That's like something. I'm not concerned with pure blood. I'm not even about skin color. That's what I'm asking. It's about who your father is. Like Lenny Kravitz and Bob Marley. These are they, 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 their fathers. Their oh, fathers were white. white. Their father was white. Right. You understand? Right. But at the same time, I, my, Mariah Carey, she looks like a white woman, but her father is black. You know right. they, What's all the one on? Derek Jeter. Bob. Derek Jeter. Uh -huh. Tiger Woods. Tiger Tiger Woods. Okay, so are, are they or Rock or are they Obama? Listen, guys, folks, the clip is Blake Griffin. You have a non black father. Are you. But you're oh, raised. But I'm not. Then you're, 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 you're not an issue. Give me the book of numbers 118. So, what about if we went back and we went back and we went back and we found in this guy's past, we got the whole world in your with church. Sam first. Father was black. But he has a problem then. If he, he goes back. Black. But I, 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 you know, it's, 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 come, it's come up in debate. Right. You have some people that come up in our organizations who don't know who they found. Right, that's what I want to say. Okay. So if the spirit brings them, yeah. then that's cool. You know, that's cool. You know? So can people convert but, or now? No, you can't convert because it's who your father is. Right. You know? So if you don't know who if you don't know who your father is, that's different. But your nationality overall is once you come to it's who your father is. Okay. Numbers 118! And they assemble all the congregation together on the first day of the second month. And they declare their pedigree. Their pedigree, meaning their nationality. Their stock they come from. Their pedigree, come on. After their family. After their families, all because your family you have to have a mother and father. So after their families, come on. By the house. By the house, come on. Of their father. Of their fathers. You understand? So they, your nationalities are turned about who your fucking fathers. You ever watched uh, uh, but the in the in the Bible the the tribes they go by their mothers nationality. No. They go no the tribal lineage is by the father, the religious lineage like the uh you think about Judaism. Right? You exactly. Know. You think about Judaism, yeah. like these things. No no but yeah. but it's in the Bible it's from the Bible. Oh, no, 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 show to me, I'll, no. I'll, I'll, I'll look at it, but yeah. I doubt that no, it's by your father. The seed of your father. Uh -huh. Look, always it's not in the Bible. Yeah. Whenever the Bible speaks about speaks about Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. It doesn't speak about Sarah and Paul. It speaks about Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. But what happened was the Jews, so-called Jews, which is known as the Kazakhs, they converted into Judaism. You see what I'm saying? Because after the Jews had fell, right, the Kazakhs, which is the fake Jews, from the Caucasians, Side, they converted Turkish. into Judaism and took it over, but they're not the real Jews. Why, why, do, you guys, why do you guys preach to me if I can? If I can, <laughs> I, I'm damned anyway, right? Yeah, you gotta pay so for what you your father parents did. But we just tell you your judgment. But you gotta pay for what your foreparents did, just like we had to pay. We came over here at the bulk of slavery. But I'm not sure my, I mean, I, I know my grandparents, like I know what my great grandparents, I'm not sure they, they did anything. Uh, That's not the point. Revelation 2 and 19. I'm going to show you. Read. This is 19 or 2 and 19. Uh, Revelation 2 and 9. Revelation chapter 2 verse 9. Come on. I know thy works and tribulation. The Lord says he knows the works and tribulations of the real Jew. The suffering. What's going on. The hell we're catching. Just like during the time of Moses. Okay. Moses came to the children of Israel was being oppressed by the Egyptians. 
they were suffering, they was catching hell. So they needed a leader through the Spirit of God in Christ. Moses came on the scene to help deliver them through the Spirit of God in Christ. The same thing's happening now. Come on. And poverty. And what? And poverty. That's the key. The poverty of the Jews. Physical poverty and spiritual poverty. We don't know. 80% of the diamonds, like over there in the diamond district, and the world wealth. The top leaders in the society are so-called Jews, from the Rockefellers, okay? The Rockchilds. The Rockchilds, you can't even imagine they wealth. They wealth is incredible. That's a big Jewish family. Open hearts and all of that. These so-called Jews are the ones that's controlled. So they're not fitting this scripture when it says poverty, come on. But thou are rich. Well, we are rich. Why? Because the glory is still coming to us. We are the seed line of David, Isaac, Jacob. You see what I'm saying? Jesus Christ. That's our seed. The Lord said, don't worry, you're rich because you're still going to have the promise. Come I, on. I got to go. Okay. But I appreciate uh, it. All right. I would love to visit your church sometime, but I, or your temple. You're in the church now. Right. Right. I can't visit. Can right I here. Temple? You come. You'll switch chains around your neck. Want to give you some good change? We'll bring you there. All right. Well, thank you. I think I'll pass on that. Some shackles on you. Can we shake? Right now. Shalom. All right. Peace, right. man. Read on. <laughs> and I know the blasphemy of them would say they are Jews. And he knows the blasphemy of them would say they are Jews. Come on. And are not. And are not. Okay. Because what's happening, brother, give me Jeremiah 16 and 19 real quick to switch. A lot of people in these last days is going to claim that they may be Jewish or that they, they Israelites. We ain't going to accept that. Until you come with your forefathers or your forefathers, we're going to teach it like it is. Because we know in the last days, that's natural for people to say, well, maybe I may be an Israelite. When they see the judgment and when they see the destruction, they're going to say, well, maybe I'm an Israelite and try to come in here. And you got idiots that's going to accept them, saying you don't have to know about your father, you can just come. Idiots like Gabal and them clowns, to her. They're going to accept them, but we're not going to accept them. Jeremiah 16 and 19, come on. Jeremiah chapter 16, verse 19. Come on. Oh Lord, my strength. Come on. And my fortress. Oh Lord, my strength and my fortress, come on. And my refuge. Come on. In the day of affliction. In the day of affliction, when people see that this, what they did, to the children of Israel, when they see what they did to the children of Israel, and they're going to realize, we did this to the blacks, we got to pay. We're being punished now for what we did to the blacks. A lot of them are going to try to compromise with us. White women are going to try to deal with us, which they, they already want to deal with a black man. But they're going to try to come and mingle among us now when they know that their time is coming to an end. Come on. The Gentiles shall come unto thee. The Gentiles going to come on to us. Come on. From the ends of the earth. Ends of the earth, come on. And shall say, surely our fathers have inherited lies. They're going to say all these lies that they inherited is no profit. They're going to say, look, these are the children of Israel. These are the real Jews. Just like you got brothers, I mean, guys on YouTube, Romania, and all over saying it, acknowledging that we're the real Jews. But that don't mean they're Israelites. Okay? Yeah, go ahead. Now, who's the, this is just for educational purposes. So who are the real Jews. So the people from the Holocaust are, these are the European Jews. Right, those are the European, you just European they Jews. Right. Right. Yeah, so who are the original these Jews? Right here. Okay. to history or... or, or no, you can tell me. You have not, no. Well, like, we always got to edify the book, okay. It says, seek you out okay. of the book of the law. So I got to show you. I got to give you the characteristics because that's the same thing they try to do. They just say they are Jews. But I got to prove the characteristics and what would happen to the real Jews. Right. Okay. Deuteronomy 28 to 68. Now, this is a prophecy that was that was supposed to happen to the real Jews. Read. Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 68. Come on. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. Now, the word Egypt is a Greek word which means bondage mm -hmm. in that sense. So the Bible said the Lord was going to bring us into bondage again. The first time we walked into Egypt. It said the Lord was going to bring us again into bondage. Come on. With ships. With what? With ships. So how did the Negroes and a lot of our people get over here? By ships. How did we get to America? By ships. No, definitely. How did we get to yeah. the West Indies? <laughs> By ships. Uh -huh. All of these, how did these people, even though uh -huh. the Dominicans, they claim it's that they're not black, most of them are black. It's just From Haitian, they're dark-skinned. Right. Right. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah. They exactly. was black. The original, they're darker than me and you, yeah. some of them. 
but they've been brainwashed. The Cubans too. But they've been brainwashed to think, look, they're not black because they worship a white Jesus. Come on. By the way, where have I spake unto thee? Come on. Thou shalt see it no more again. Come on. And there you shall be sold unto your enemies. So that ship was representing slave ships. It was brought over here by slave ships. Come on. For bond men and bond women. Bond men and bond women. Now give me the.